Hi, Aunt Elaine. We wanted to wish you a happy 99th birthday. Sorry we can't be there with you, but we put together a video uh, for you with uh, Dad doing quite a bit of the taping. Uh, we did a little editing, so hopefully you'll enjoy it. And happy birthday from all of us. Happy uh, birthday. Happy birthday. Darlene's behind the camera and May's <laughs> Happy birthday. Right now, so happy Peace. birthday. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Okay, Good now we and here's mommy. <laughs> what? Is this Jakey? Is this Jakey? I mean, yeah. I'm Jakey! You're Jakey? Yeah. You're Jakey, huh? <laughs> All right. Jakey's in the blue and Joey's in the green. All right. All right. Hey guys, look over toward the camera here a minute. Okay, this is everybody smiling. This is Grandma. I'm going to step back here so I can get a little bit more in. There's Grandma and Nikki and, and Joey. Okay. Oh boy, look at this. Grandma, Nikki, and Joey. And Nikki's got his Pokemon. And Joey is standing so nice and quiet. Oh boy. Now you want to look at it? See what happened? Look at your Pokemon. Here, I'll get out of the way. No, you, you'll be good. You, you can let him show it to you. How many, have you gotten any new ones this morning? Yeah. You got some new ones this morning? Yes. No, not this morning, but lately. Lately? I got one new one yesterday. You got just driving around, or uh, did you just go walk through the neighborhood? Driving. Driving? What new one did you get? Polyrath. Polyrath, huh? This. Oh, that one. Okay. Where's Joey? <laughs> And I also, and yesterday I also got a dragon, a dragon, a dragon. All right. Ring. Beep Ready? Yes, we're ready. Ready. Kara in Chicago. I'm in my backyard and I'm making this video to wish you a happy 99th birthday. Um, I'm outside. It's a gorgeous day. We get beautiful weather here in Chicago uh, for a way too brief time. Uh, this is my garden. I thought I'd show you some of the pretty flowers that we were able to grow this year. Um, but most importantly, happy 99th birthday to you. I understand that Leanne's birthday is coming up as well. So happy birthday and that Gwen is there. Hello, Lyndon, Sue and Kristen, all my cousins and the family. I understand you're having quite a celebration and you deserve it. I tell stories about you all the time. You have led the most interesting life. You are an inspiration to me and always have been. You were independent before it was cool. 
Um, I tell stories about how you served our country, the amazing time that you and Leona drove across the country together. I would be afraid, I think, to do that now. Um, you met the Beatles. You flew in on the same plane as the Beatles before the Ed Sullivan appearance. It's just what a cool lady you are. I have such fond memories of how beautifully you kept your homes. Um, Colonial Vista, gorgeous. Um, the view in your home and of the valley. Uh, some of my fondest memories are up at Lake Wenatchee at the cabin. I still think about that stuffed armadillo and how beautiful the cabin was. How wonderfully you kept it, all the lunches that you would prepare for us and all of the cousins jumping into the lake, Lloyd taking us out on the boat, us all trying to water ski. <laughs> Um, I was talking to my mom and dad this morning and we remembered that we actually experienced one of the less devastating uh, Mount St. Helen eruptions together. We had gone out on the boat and we had crossed Lake Wenatchee and we were kind of on a little hike and suddenly the, the ground kind of shook like this and we heard a boom. And we thought, oh, there must be a logging truck. And I think I jokingly said, oh, maybe it's Mount St. Helens. And lo and behold, when we woke up in the morning, we'd all spent the night at the cabin. There was a fine layer of dust all over the patio and on our cars. And sure enough, there was an eruption. Um, I love you very much. I wish I could be there with you, but happy, happy birthday. And thank you for all the gifts you've given us, especially for chronicling our family's history, um, saving all of Grandma May and Grandpa Claude's letters. We look at those quite frequently, and thank you for taking the time to write our family history. It's such a gift to the family. I hope you have a gorgeous day and happy 99th birthday. I love you very much. Uh, there's another video coming shortly. There's somebody else who wants to tell you happy birthday. I love you. Bye. This is Kyle. He's in the fifth grade at All Saints Academy. And Kyle, you had a baseball game this morning. Mm -hmm. How did you do in the baseball game? Good, we won. You won. And did you get any hits? Yeah, I got two singles. You got two singles. What positions were you playing? Well, most of them play like switch positions. So we like play most of them. Did you pitch any? Uh, no. How are you doing in cross country? Good. I've improved my time a lot. Have you improved your time? Mm -hmm. What's your time? What are you running? Uh, you're a mile in, huh? Uh, well, my fastest time so far has been 718. Your fastest has been 718. That would take me a long time. <laughs> uh, Kyle, um, let's have you stand beside Grandma because you're catching Grandma. Oh my goodness, little Kyle in the fifth grade, grandma's, he's up to grandma's eyeglasses. What are you going to do when you, when you catch her, Kyle? Close her up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm still the boss, though. <laughs> uh, Kyle, uh, how are you doing in Pokemon? Good, I'm on level 20. You're up to level 20 now? Mm -hmm. How many characters do you have? Seventy-six. Wow. Now, can you only have one, like, do you have a Pikachu? Yeah, I have two. You have two Pikachus. What's your strongest character? Um, like, uh, Vaporeon. Vaporeon? Yeah. Yeah, um, he's pretty strong. Kyle, tell him what Pokemon is. Well, it's like a game you try to 
try to catch all the Pokemon. And you join the team, which is all the fun. So you do it with your cell phone. And uh, where, where did you catch your most recent Pokemon? Um, well, I mean, the best spot I know is downtown Chicago. Downtown Chicago? They have a lot of Pokestops and like Pokemon. Have you been downtown to Chicago to catch them? Yes, once. Once? Who are you with? My family. Your family? Did they catch Pokemons too or just you? Um, yeah, they caught some too. Oh, wow. Hey, well, thanks a lot, Kyle. We'll all get together pretty soon and sing happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see which one you like. 2015, huh? Where's 2016? Uh, no, this would, this, this would be it. They got it last fall. Yeah, so this yeah, is it, yeah. yeah. These two beauties are little Madeline and little Darlene, and it's been a few years since you've seen them. They're in their prom outfits. No, they're in their homecoming outfits. Now, the tall one is actually Darlene, who is 14 years old now, and. Uh, the shorter one is Madeline. Uh, Madeline, what's it like to have Darlene taller than you? Um, it's okay. She just likes to pick on me. Maybe she thinks that she's taller and bigger, but yeah. <laughs> and Darlene, what's it like to be taller than your sister? Uh, I like it a lot because everyone thinks that I'm older than she is. And I get to look down at her. <laughs> and, uh, Madeline, where's your home coming at? Mine's at Bennett. You're, you're at Bennett. Will it be at the high school, at Bennett High School itself? Yeah, it'll be in the gymnasium. There. Okay. And uh, where will your homecoming be? Um, mine will be at St. Francis. It will be at St. Francis. Mm -hmm. Which gym at St. Francis? Um, it'll be in the larger gym, and the larger gym is called Spyglass. Okay. And um, Madeline, do you have a favorite class in high school? Maybe chemistry, because just because it's easy and I have a lot of my friends in my class. Okay. Darlene, have you found a favorite class yet? Um, I don't really know. Probably math, because it's really easy. And I'm the only freshman in that class, but I still know some people, so... <laughs> Gals, do either of you have any memory of the last time you were in the state of Washington? Not really. We were really um, little. Not really. I mean, I remember eating jelly beans a little <laughs> bit. I remember eating jelly beans. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> okay. Well, after a while, we'll all sing happy birthday. So thank you very much, Madeline and Darlene.